posing for photographs, like not me. <laughs> He's called me all natural. Smiling happy. Yeah, that, that won't last. I've seen it as the camera's gone. It's going yeah. into my usual grumpy. Yeah. I went to a Caribbean <laughs> island once and a massive cruise ship came in and all of the fat Americans got on. <laughs> And uh, the, yeah, they all rolled off, and the whole of the capital Literally. city, which was extremely sleepy, yeah. suddenly transformed into a hotbed of hassling. Oh. Suddenly, all these people arrived to hassle these tourists and flog them stuff. And then, um, you know, the, uh, later that day, the boat left and it all went back to sleep again. I thought the only experience those people on the boat have of this Caribbean island is of getting off and being harassed. Yeah. And, you know, I'm already here and uh, it's very sleepy and nobody bothers me. But because they were coming along with their American dollars and no idea of what things were worth, they were very soft. I love the way you just naturally. Right, yeah. I've enjoyed this. Um, <laughs> now, what do you think of um, well, Mr. Big Happy Christmas, Johnny. Thank you, darling. You now take that away. <laughs> yes. Has he got two pairs of cold spreads? Yes, so I, can, I can't get close enough to the camera. You don't get to the side of the road. You're just a super contrast. I think that I know myself that I need. I love the spontaneity of meeting people and putting myself into situations when I'm travelling that I can. People, people try to call me the Mark Lee's cow. He's pointing to the press. A lot of it is about to film you. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. so we were saying about the cow. I'm not the one who likes chocolate cake. <laughs> <laughs> we know he likes a bit of chocolate cake. <laughs> Go on, go and have a You've done very well at not having any chocolate yeah. cake. You haven't had any today. No, and you didn't have any chocolate tart either. They're both available up there. And they're both as good as each other. Yeah. Oh, you have to try both though to see I which one you prefer. Chocolate cake. Chocolate cake, definitely, because it was like a chocolate fudge cake. Yeah, well that's why you need you need to try them both. Yeah, and the icing just, you know, did it for me. The chocolate icing, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think you overfilled up on the meat. It's actually chocolate frosting. You had a bit too much meat, didn't you? What sort of meat was it? <laughs> Beef, yeah. And a bit of turkey. Oh, yeah. oh did you? Which was yeah, well, that's what the whole cruise is, isn't it? I'd still go to Portsmouth, so that's a nice experience. So well done, Sassy. I know. That was like, she used to do them quite regularly. And then he says, I've got a good guess. Brilliant. I'm going to ask whether we have to start there. <laughs> they've, they've just, they've just, they've just green lit the. Uh, <laughs> it's the <laughs> I hope you went for the cake. It was actually a tart. Really, you've got to have a friend though, so you can have half each. That was my mistake. You sure you don't want any chocolate? <laughs> Very nice. It's not as nice as the tart. <laughs> yeah, the problem is it doesn't turn out nice. But you have to get your own spoon as well. I've come over all the way over here and I have to sit down. Now she'll get some tart while you're at that. Well, do you want something? Would you like a bit of tart? You like chocolate tart? Oh, that's very kind. Thank you very much. Are you sure? Have you made your mind up? I've made my mind up. Yeah, once you've made your mind up, there's no good. Yeah, I know. You're very determined. They want me to restore something. Anybody else? Ooh, look at that. Ooh. The cream on it as well. That's chocolate cake. cake. <laughs> and it's, they are so terrifying. We're just saying we love the way that you talk yourself into having lots of chocolate cake. It's fantastic. I like a bit of chocolate cake. <laughs> chocolate fudge cake. I like it with a bit of single cream. That's the way they do it at the Thistle Hotel on the seafront. <laughs> you know, you know, I come here every Christmas. <laughs> 1981 when the place was built. Before that, you couldn't come to the Thistle Hotel because it didn't exist. In 1981, they built it. All right changed. Never been the same since. I come here every Christmas. It's like being on a cruise.
Oh, and say it, hey, all day. <laughs> Bloody brilliant. I, 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 chocolate cake, <laughs> chocolate fudge cake. They do, they do it. They do a chocolate tart. A chocolate tart. What, what sort of variety um, is that? Sure That's not a cotton fudge cake, is it? No, it's a short. It's kind of short crust. Short crust pastry. Pastry on the outside. And then there's some flavouring in the chocolate of the chocolate tart. Like pure chocolate. Is it pure chocolate? Pure it's 100 percent cacao. If you, if you had the tart, you'd find out what it was yeah. all about. Yeah, I couldn't have the tart as well. <laughs> Yeah, you want a chocolate? What about the chocolate <laughs> tart? <laughs> you don't eat chocolate. <laughs> I find that very hard to believe. Surely everybody enjoys chocolate. We don't eat chocolate. What about at Christmas? Really. Say there was in the Thistle Hotel on the Brighton <laughs> Sea Road <laughs> of a Christmas. <laughs> Celebrate. <laughs> I'd say a chocolate fudge cake is what you'd want. <laughs> Or possibly a chocolate tart. I mean, there's the choice, isn't there? There's always a choice to be made. It's a large and wide-ranging buffet up there. It's just all about chocolate, you know. They've got fruit salad. What did you have in your fruit salad? Fruit salad. They've got millet, millet in the fruit salad. And papaya, do you know? Papaya's quite an exotic fruit. They had uh, uh, mango, but it was a little bit hard, as I said. The grape. Grape. See, people don't really, they don't really experience anything, they just record it to prove that they was there. <laughs> I come here every Christmas. <laughs> Since 1981 when the Thistle Hotel was um, regular uh, royal funerals. <laughs> Johnny, what do you do all this nonsense? Film. I come here every Christmas. <laughs> Since 1981, when the place was built. Before that, you couldn't come to the place of that because it didn't exist. In 1981, they built it. All right changed. Never been the same since. I come here every Christmas. It's like being on a cruise. 